What are some home remedies for ear mites? Well, I mean, honestly, your best bet of course of action for ear mites is just to run down to your local pet store and, and pick up some insecticidal ear wash. Um, it's the easiest, quickest, and fastest thing to do. Um, barring that, say if your animal has some sort of uh, uh, allergy or sensitivity to insecticides, uh, you want to try something a little bit more natural. Uh, there are ways you can do that. Uh, the first thing you need to, of course, do is make sure you clean the ear out very, very well uh, with some sort of ear cleaning solution and some cotton balls and Q-tips. Be very, very careful not to uh, uh, get too deep into the ear canal. You don't want to um, damage anything. Um, once you have the ear cleaned out very, very well, uh, the first uh, type of uh, medication you can use is uh, it's uh, nine drops of uh, yellow dock root extract. Don't ask me where to get it because... I've never done it before, but I've just heard about people doing it. Um, and you mix that with one tablespoon of water. You're going to take a, a little uh, like baby ear syringe or an eyedropper, and you're going you're to apply that into the ear. And then you're going to uh, make sure the dog doesn't shake it out. You're going you're gonna to massage the ear with that in there for a few minutes or so. And then um, you can let the dog shake his head out and maybe use some cotton balls to clean up any excess. You're going to want to do that uh, treatment every three days for a period of about three weeks. Um, doing that should take care of any ear mite problems. Barring that, the second treatment you can, you can try is a mixture of a, a half ounce of almond oil with 400 IUs of vitamin E. You're going to mix that, you're going to warm it up to about body temperature or so, you're going to apply half an eyedropper into each infected ear, and then again massage the ears very very well, clean up any excess with cotton balls, and you're going to do that for about a period of about six days and then you're gonna leave it for three days and then do it again for another six days that should take care of any ear mite problems as well but again both of these solutions are a little more involved than really necessary unless your animal has some sort of uh, uh, potential health risk with the insecticide or or you, you yourself have some sort of health risk with it or have some other uh, hindering the use of an insecticide uh, just go ahead and, and purchase an insecticide, uh, insecticidal ear wash remedy from a pet store. It's, it's a heck of a lot easier and it's only going to cost you five or six bucks.